Lucky number 7, Jelly Roll and Bunny XO celebrate their anniversary by renewing their wedding vows in a Vegas ceremony. Again, Jelly Roll and Bunny XO said I do. At the same Las Vegas chapel where they were married in 2016, the 38-year-old country music star and his wife, the presenter of the Dumb Blonde podcast, reaffirmed their vows on Thursday. The luckiest girl alive is lucky number 7 slot machine. Tonight was very amazing sparkles. Bunny posted a video of the couple's wedding on Instagram along with the post. Bunny said that they were organizing the wedding in July. This year, Jay and I are renewing our vowels. Bunny XO made a Facebook post, and since I didn't wear a real wedding dress the first time we got married in that little chapel in Vegas, I'm going to wear one this time. She went on, I know some of my bride savvy mommies out there know some designers, or websites I can go on for one, but I'm having the worst difficulty finding an all naked colored wedding dress. I'm not into weddings, help, the woman wrote. Jelly Roll said on a recent edition of the Bobby Bones show that the wedded couple chose to reaffirm their vows due to uncertainty over their wedding date. Because we got married at like 1 o'clock in the morning, they let us pick our anniversary so we don't know which day we actually got married on, he said. We're going to play in Vegas on our anniversary this year, probably between August 30th and September 1st, he said. We're going to leave the show when I play Vegas that night, head straight back to the small chapel where we got married, and repeat the whole thing. We're going to go on a genuine date this way. The first time Jelly Roll and Bunny XO exchanged vows was at a chapel in Las Vegas in 2016. During his theatrical performance, Jelly Roll proposed to Bunny XO. The pair exchanged vows on the spur of the moment that same evening. The two initially crossed paths in 2015 when attending the country singer's shows at Country Saloon in Las Vegas. Despite Bunny XO's romantic involvement at the time, the two maintained their friendship. Jelly Roll said on the comedic podcast King and the Sting and the Wing clips that their friendship swiftly took a sexual turn once Bunny XO became single. I could just feel how genuine she was when I gave her a hug, he said. I knew it wasn't a performance.